to Titan Championship Wrestling presents Blaze of Glory here at the legendary Highline Arena in Aberdeen, New Jersey. Alex Aceta here with Harry Trujani and Harry, welcome to Titan Championship Wrestling. Alex, what a pleasure it is to be here, home of the Titans, and we are kicking it off in style with a lightweight championship match. And look at this, how lucky are we? Hey, TKO, everybody. Yeah. How ow, lucky ow, 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 ow. I need those fingers, TKO. How, how lucky are you, buddy? You got a handshake from TKO. Yeah, I can't feel my hand now. Ah, that's all right. You get, you'll live off the clout for years. Look at him, just styling and profiling the next big hit. TKO enamored with himself, as he should be. My well, longtime fans of Titan Championship Wrestling will be familiar with the somewhat spotty history. Uh, what is this? Ring announcer Samira has just taken off her jacket to reveal a Genesis t-shirt. Hey, listen, she's got style, she's got grace, she knows what's up, she knows where, she knows where to move. And here he comes, the reigning and defending Titan Championship Wrestling lightweight champion, Mr. 1-800-Bangers himself, Daniel Alexander. I tried to call 1-800-Bangers, it was disconnected. The lightweight champion. A fan favorite for sure, and here we go. Well, where Daniel Alexander goes, a dance party soon follows. They don't call him the energy for nothing. Certainly has a lot of energy but I don't know how much, how wise it is to waste all that energy in a pre-match ritual like that. The fans sure love it, but it might cost him this championship. Ladies and gentlemen, this match. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, This is a surprise. The Titan kids coming to give Daniel Alexander a special ring introduction. Now leave it to Daniel Alexander to hire labor from kids. How terrible. Yeah, so, and apparently somehow this is my fault. And here are the kids. And star the puppet. Of course, several weeks ago, Titan Enterprise CEO Billy Fetsky made the groundbreaking announcement that Titan Kids was making its highly anticipated return. So we have Stevie, Jay, and Little Miss Madison in the ring now. ring introduction going to take here? What's what's going on here? What do you think, 
doing, baby? Oh, I'm damn good. Them chicken fingers, them chicken fingers, finger licking pretty quick, right? Yeah. Okay, everybody, let's see how we do it. Could we just start the match here? What is going on? Listen, let the kid have his birthday fun. Well, she can read, we know that much. This Aberdeen, New Jersey crowd really endearing, my, endearing themselves to they, me. They don't know anything. They live in Aberdeen. Finally. Can we make sure those kids paid to get in here? Make sure they didn't get in here for free. Well, Harry, I want to take you back to earlier this month as Titan Championship Wrestling presented Ignition from Avenel, New Jersey. Daniel Alexander, of course, the newly crowned lightweight champion, laid out an open challenge to anyone in the back for tonight's event. And it was TKO Kosenko who answered that challenge in a heated backstage confrontation. Well, a, a smart move by TKO to answer this challenge, to pick up on the opportunity. And I'm not gonna say it's not a brave move by Daniel Alexander. I don't know how wise it is to just lay out an open challenge. That limits the amount of time you can train and prepare. And here we go. TKO does not like the reception Alexander got. Well, it's no t secret, TK Okasenko, a prolific uh, YouTuber, vlogger. This is a man who craves the spotlight. Craves the validation of his audience. Always tries to keep his uh, like-dislike ratio in the green. Okay, and oh, well, he got a like for me for that move. You never turn your back on your opponent. And TKO started things off with a cheap shot on well, Daniel Alexander. Listen, that's Daniel Alexander's fault. It's his fault. In his first title defense, it just shows you. Ooh. Ooh. Alexander firing back. A knee to the gut there. An Irish whip. But Alexander up and over. Ooh, drop kick. Single leg drop kick. The ability, agility, I should say, of Daniel Alexander on full display. Neck breaker. And there's no denying the speed and effort. The energy, that's why he is the energy. Oh! Standing moonsault from Alexander. This could be over before it started and only enough for a one count. And I gotta give him credit, when he landed that moonsault, he laid his entire abdomen on top, putting all of the weight on TKO. And you can see as TKO limps away, all of the impact. There's no denying the skill and talent of Alexander. That's without a doubt. Daniel Alexander hot on the pursuit now. Ooh. Ooh. And a smart move to take advantage here. This is Alexander's first title defense. It is ever since winning that title from Rocket back at American Spirit and, in July. And now why is the kid getting involved here? This should be a disqualification. Ooh. Well, Daniel, Daniel Alexander says it with his whole chest. He is 100% for the youth. And TKO wisely getting in the ring to break the count. And another kid wants to get in. See, this is what happens with the youth. Referee being very generous with this uh, count. Well, TKO did break it up, but it should be yeah. started. Oh! Top of the, as we all know, the hardest part of the ring. Absolutely, and TKO very wisely trying to immobilize that lower uh, lumbar region. Yeah, we well, can't. To perhaps try to uh, 
neutralize Daniel Alexander's high-flying offense. Well, it's hard to jump and leap with a broken back, and TKO setting up perhaps for a, some type of, oh no, rolling out of the ring. Another vicious shot laid across the chest of Daniel Alexander. A couple dance moves there to boot. Robert Daniel Alexander set to fly. Oh! Tope Suicida by Daniel Alexander. And TKO will not be putting that on one of his reels. A big problem right now for TKO. Alexander firmly in control here. Now here's a little bit of a delay from Alexander trying to figure out what to do next. Ooh, look at those deadly kicks. There it is, the educated feet of Daniel Alexander on full display. Oh, smartly by TKO. See, that's the difference. It takes a just a second, an opportunity. Just any delay can cost you. And this is what Alexander is learning. Oh, a nice sharp elbow drop. There's a difference between winning the championship and keeping it. On a very braggadocious pin attempt there from TKO. Winning a championship is an achievement, but it, it does happen. There are flukes. Keeping the championship, that is something that is much more difficult. And this is just uncalled for. TKO driving that knee in the back of the neck he of has, Daniel Alexander. He has to the count of five. He uses it. Ooh. Alexander fighting back. Oh, see, and again, that's the, the he's too focused on the children, too focused on the kids. He should be focused on this championship. Is maybe this might be too much for him. It's his first title defense. It might be his last. One, two. Only a two count. But Daniel Alexander, I will say, in this kind of high stakes environment, sometimes the energy that the crowd provides you, having them on your side, could be the difference maker in this type of matchup. It most definitely can. But a way to take the crowd out of it. Ooh, if TKO can land a knockout blow, no pun intended. But right now it's a back and forth Beautiful uppercut. uppercut. Yeah, well done. But look at that. Spine to the pine there from TKO. Again, only enough for a two count. What is it gonna take to put the champ away? There's a lot of determination, a lot of heart from Alexander, no doubt about it. It's just a question of focus as far as I'm concerned. Again, this first title, oh, okay. Wait a second. And star the puppet. TKO, hoping to make Star go viral, maybe. And the, the, did he just get slapped by the puppet? Oh no, oh he's gonna put the puppet. Maybe an Alabama slam. Oh, he just hit the outro on Star the Puppet. That puppet has a family. Oh, wait a second, Daniel Alexander back on the apron. Oh. Springboard drop kick. Ooh, a nice sharp lariat clothesline. Reverse elbow. Oh, TKO caught him though. Alexander trying to sneak through. Ooh, Superman punch. A variation of it. Beautiful, Daniel Alexander's got TKO right where he wants him. Under the ring, but again, as you mentioned before, Harry, that gloating. It's a little bit too much control. focus. The leg could be looking for eat the feet connects. Oof, and, and TKO is dazed here. Going for the cover. One, two. TKO kicking out. TKO tough as nails. You gotta give it to him for all the social media showboating he does. He's not an easy opponent here. And that's the dangerous of the dangers of laying out an open challenge to just anybody. Reluctantly agree, and Daniel Alexander, that frustration playing on his face. TKO sweeping away from that suplex, and Ooh, thunder bomb. One, two, and a kick out by Alexander. TKO beginning to be a little bit frustrated here. TKO reaching into the tank, pulling out moves I've never seen him done before. Well, that's what it takes. You know, you got to rise to the occasion for these championship matches. You gotta not let the moment be bigger than you. You have to be bigger than the moment. And this well, is a big a opportunity. Samira just slid a steel chair to TKO. 
She's the ring announcer. She's supposed to be impartial. Uh, oh, no. TKO. Going to get himself disqualified. Oh, hurting his hands. There it is. The sling bang. The sling bang there and another go. one. We saw it coming. He set him up for it. And Alexander, what is he going to do with the chair? Oh, come on, Daniel. You're better than this. Samira now up on the ring apron on one side. And See, the what is kids. going on? These children should not be. First of all, where are their parents? They're, they should not be allowed here. Also, oh, wait they a pay to get in? But Daniel Alexander playing possum, it looks like. Samira did what, not hit him with that chair. What, what is going on here? That's not right. That is not right. No, she didn't do anything. Nobody got hit with that chair. Okay, this is ridiculous. Right, wait a second. Daniel Alexander scooching over to that corner while the referee's back was turned. And these kids getting becoming a major distraction. Big drop kick sends TKO to the corner. And Daniel Alexander going to the top. Could he be looking for that two, six, seven connects? One, two, three. That's all she wrote. Daniel Alexander will retain his lightweight championship. A uh, rightfully lackluster announcement as Daniel Alexander retains in his first title defense the TCW Lightweight Championship. Thanks to the help of these little brats. Well, you can cry and complain all you want, Samira, but that's what you get for introducing a foreign object. What about these kids? Some of them are foreign. Some of them might be a foreign object. And look at these kids getting in the ring, dirtying the canvas.